so excited to be actually filming a video today sitting in front of my camera because it has actually been a while since I have had time to sit down and film um, a video actually talking to you guys. I've just been crazy busy lately and I have also on top of that I have been sick for over three weeks now. I've been sick since winter break and it just will not go away and it is so Ugh, it is terrible. So that's why, you know, I've been going a little bit longer with putting up videos. I like to put them up every other day, but that hasn't really been possible lately, especially also because I have been traveling a lot lately. I got back from LA a few days ago from IMATS, and before that I was in San Francisco, which you guys would know if you like follow me on Twitter and Instagram and all that stuff, and I had so much fun on those trips. Um, I was sick while I was there, but I still had so much fun, and that is why today I'm going to be showing you guys my LA haul what I purchased while I was there. Um, some of you asked if I could show what I bought in San Francisco and I really don't even think I bought anything. I got some things from you guys who came to our meetup which was super super sweet but I didn't really have time to actually go shopping while I was there because I was there for just a short amount of time so um, I didn't need to anyway because I knew I was going to go to LA and do some shopping with my friends so um, I did get a few things. I'm going to show you the things that I got at IMATS and I'm going to show you something from Sigma that I got. I went to their party and it was super fun and then I'm going to show you um, a few of the like clothing and accessories that I bought also. So I'll start with the clothing and fashion items that I got and then I will go ahead and do the like makeup stuff from IMAT. So first of all, um, we went to the store Cotton On and I don't have a Cotton On so um, I was really excited to go. Um, I've actually never got anything from there before I don't think. I wanted to go because I saw that they had this purse and this purse is like a dupe you could say for the um, Alexander Wang Rocky bag which is the ones with the studding on the bottom. They have a bigger version and a smaller one and I like the Rocky the smaller one I was at the Sigma party and I saw my friend Kara had this bag and I was like oh my gosh is that um, the Rocky bag and she was like no I got this from cotton on for like $30 and I was like that is literally the exact bag but it is so much cheaper so I went to hunt it down at cotton on and I found it and I'm so glad I did because they were also having 30% off of the entire store so this bag was originally 30. The higher end, the Alexander Wang bag of this is 800 bucks, which is really expensive, but obviously it's like really nice quality and real leather and stuff. But um, why I like it so much is it has studding at the bottom and then it's like you can carry it like this in like a top handle and you can also carry it crossbody. So I love this and it was only, as I said, 30% off of $30. So it was a very good deal and I'm very excited to use this. I find myself, I really use black bags match with most of the stuff I wear so I wanted to get it in black they also had it in brown which Christy actually got the brown one but I am so excited so Kara if you happen to be watching this thank you so much for saving me like all that money because I really was so in love with it that I probably would have gotten the um, real version but you know what this is just so much better and then since the whole store was 30% off and I had never been to cotton on before I decided I would look around at some clothes as well and they actually had so much cute stuff and they had kind of brought in some of their spring stuff and I know it's not spring for a few months but um, I just kind of wanted to get this stuff now because as I said I don't have a cotton on and I really liked some of it and I know I'll wear it so, um, first of all, I got this dress, which came in a few colors, but I really, really liked this one. It's kind of like a periwinkle blue. Um, I think it's a periwinkle blue. And I really like it. It's just flowy and lacy, and then the back has like a V cut at the back. And I just really like this and think it's girly and pretty. And this was 30 and then 30% off as well. I also got this skirt, which I really like. It's like a circle skirt. I really love flowy skirts and I love floral print especially for spring so I really like this one and this one was super cheap it was only $14.95 and then again 30% off so I felt like this store was really decently priced and I'm kind of like hey I want one of these stores around me and I got um, these leggings because I am obsessed with leggings. I made a whole video about my legging collection if you guys want to check that out. Um, these ones are all black on the back and then they have black on the sides but then cream on the front. I don't know. I just really like them and thought again they're neutral to match with a lot of stuff I wear and leggings are just so much comfier than pants to me. I just yeah. And these were $24.95 and then 
30% off, which I keep I keep saying, but it was just it was a really good like deal. And this was such an amazing deal. This was in the sale rack, and this dress was originally it was only $20, but then it was marked down to $10, and obviously everything was 30% off. So I got this dress for seven dollars it's just this like bodycon dress with this lovely little print in the middle and I just I think this is really pretty I like tight dresses form-fitting dresses and seven dollars I really just could not pass that up and then the last clothing item that I got from there was these pants and I'm in love with these these completely scream spring to me love 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 pattern pants and I love that these are like a pale yellow with florals on them and they're so pretty and these were only um, $29.95 and then 30% off. So like, how could I say no? I couldn't, I cannot wait to wear these in a couple months. And then lastly, I got this pair of combat boots because I thought they were a really cool color. They're like a greenish, taupey, brown, gray. If that makes any sense, I don't really know what exact color they are. I guess they're more like a light brown. Um, but I really like them, they're like a shorter than normal comp my voice sounds really weird. It's shorter than normal combat boot. They were, okay, I don't know what the price of these was. It fell off, but I don't think they were that expensive. Now I have just a few things from Brandy Melville. So I got um, two headbands and they wrapped them in these really cute little bags, which I like, you know, I like the extra detail and I like the free little, the free little bag. So um, these were only $3, which I thought was really nice. And I love floral headbands. Well, I just love floral in general. And um, so this one just looks like this. It's more of like a peachy neutral one. This one is like a black or a navy blue with some blue and purple florals and I just like wearing these like that. I got this ring which I really like and it was only three dollars as well. It's just this small gold ring and it has two hearts here and it's just like a small delicate ring. I love their jewelry and this was like the only thing that really I felt like I could justify buying because I have so much jewelry. And then I got two shirts. This one is just a plain simple um, like light sweater but it was not ex as expensive as most of their sweaters. I don't know how to describe the bottom but it like goes down like that and then the back goes down like that. I don't know <laughs> what I'm trying to say but it's just super super soft and comfy and I got this because um, it goes with everything and it, I actually ended up wearing it while I was there. I wore it um, one of the days because it matched with my pants that I wore and it's so soft. I wish you could feel it. It's just really comfy and it's a basic and I wanted it. And then I got this shirt which is kind of one of like a touristy shirt. I don't know. It says Los Angeles and then it says New York. I like how the New York is written upside down and um, a couple of us got this shirt. I don't know why we just all kind of liked it. They had it in a few different colors and me and my YouTube friends have been to LA and New York together now so I thought it was kind of like a symbol of that and I also really love the color of it and I just I think it's cute and it wasn't too expensive at all and that's all I got from Brady Melville and then the only other clothing item I got is from Free People which a moment for the bag it is so cute and I just got this pair of pants I absolutely love free people's pants. I think they're very unique and you don't see them a lot of other places, which makes sense. I don't I don't know what I'm saying. Have some stripes, like pinstripes all the way down and then they're kind of like bleached in places and I just think they look really cool and they're like a different alternative to just a typical jean but they would kind of match with everything that a jean would. I have to show you what I got from Sigma. One because I love their bags. They have adorable bags and also because I am so excited about this product. So I didn't get this at IMATS. I got it at the Sigma party. They have an event for some of um, their affiliates and things like that and so I went to the party. It was super super fun and they gave away to everyone that went their new resort palette which is coming out sometime in the spring and it is beautiful. So um, um, I will let you guys know when it is available, but I wanted to give you like a first look at it because I am just very excited about it and I hope I can do some sort of look with it soon, like when it more closer to when it comes out. But I love it. So this side is like neutrals, which I love, and then this side is colors. So it's a nice mix um, of neutrals and colors. And then we have a blush here, and we have a liquid highlighter, which this is their first liquid highlighter they've ever done, and then a dual-ended eyeliner in blue and brown. And you have a mirror, and look how cute the front of it is. 
I am very, very excited about this palette and to use it. All right, and now on to the eye mask stuff. This is my bag. I always love getting an eye mask bag. I've collected a few of them now. And yeah, this one just looks like this. And I did not get, this bag is pretty full, but um, it's only full because I was lucky enough to get a press pass, which you can get a press pass to cover your eye mask ticket if you have over 100,000 subscribers. It, they kind of change the rule all the time, but um, you can see on the website, it's currently, um, you can apply if you have 100,000 subscribers. So this was my first time having one and I was very happy. So they were very kind and when we got there they gave us um, this bag which had a lot of lovely gifts in it. The only thing that I actually did buy was I got beauty blenders and I got three of them because me and Chrissy went to look for some and they only had a huge pack of them so they had six in there so she got three and I got three and I am obsessed. The only thing I don't like about beauty blenders is that they do get stained with your foundation easily. So that is why I got three because I really like the look of them looking really clean. So yeah, and it was such a good deal. The pack for six was, and and a cleanser was $60. So they were like under $10 a piece and they're usually like 20 or $22 I think a piece. All of this other stuff I think, yeah, was what I got in here other than this brush set which is from Purse Buzz. I met her when I was on the benefit trip and she is such a sweet girl. So we went over to visit her booth and say hi and she gave me and Christy um, a brush set which is very, very nice. Let's see, what else is in here? We have this purple little bag and in here is some poise makeup like a cream blush and something else that I can't see. I'm not gonna like show all of you guys this stuff just because I didn't like buy any of it. Bello CO Flawless Airbrush Makeup. A pair of lashes from Elegant Lashes. Grande Mascara Lash Boosting Formula. The Ultimate Artist Carry All and then it just has like stuff about Zuka which the brand is Zuka. Samples from Lipo Lotion. <laughs> all right. Um, then we have some Young Blood Cosmetics samples. So I guess some of the brands that were there just like put um, samples for us in the bag. This, which is a giant bronzer and it's really pretty. This is from City Color and it has a palm tree in it which is really pretty. So I'll be trying that out. This I'm excited about is a Lime Crime lipstick and it's in the shade Glamour. And I actually already looked at this. It's like a super dark red, <laughs> like a brown red. So not sure if it'll look good on me, but hey, we'll try it out. And then I got Magic Stylo Semi-Permanent Eye Pen in Black Velvet. Always, I'm excited to try out this because I love liquid liner. And then Senna Sketch a Brow Precision Brow Pencil. And then the last thing I got is the Perian Spirit Professional Makeup Brush Cleanser, which I've actually heard great things about this. And it's a spray, which is nice because I can just use it like over at my vanity. I'm not the best about keeping up with cleaning my brushes, so I just like something easy and quick. So that is all that's in my eye mask bag. So that's everything I got while I was in LA. I hope you guys enjoyed this video because it was very requested. So go ahead and like it down below if you liked it. And yeah, I hope you guys are having an amazing day. And um, if you want to see what I did while I was in LA, I'm actually today going to be starting putting up those vlogs. If you want to see also what I did while I was in San Francisco with Benefit, I did three vlogs and those are all up on my personal channel, Living Like Lindsay, which will be linked in the down bar. And then um, I did like three or four LA vlogs. So I'm really excited to put those up. I'm a little bit behind because I've been sick. I'm putting those up, but those will be up on my personal channel if you want to see more videos. Less like beauty stuff and more fun stuff. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye!